Hello, hello. Have you all guys ever tried light painting before? Because today we're going to do something more. Hi everyone, I'm Greg Chow. And I'm Edwin Ng. And today we're going to talk about uh, creative light painting using the Maggie Maggie light. light. Recently, we got our hand on the Maggie Light and basically it's a tool to enable you to do light painting at night. You can come up with the different kinds of lights effect that you want. In front of me, this uh, the bag, the travel bag that come together with the Maggie Light. It's from Photo Gears. So let's see what's inside the bag. So this is for additional protection and there's a user manual, a charger, also comes together with two batteries. This is the Maggie Light. Another interesting thing is that it also comes together with this tiny version of Maggie Light. They call it mini LED bar. It has a 43 LED and this one has 144 LED and this is one meter long and yeah. this is 30 centimeter long. My first thought when I have a hole of this Maggi Light is that it's very light. You know, at this like 100cm, it only weighs at around 1kg. The lightweight is very important to me to draw a very smooth and nice beautiful line and shape. It's actually a very creative uh, device where you can customize whatever you want to paint. You can even include it your own photo and you can just paint it out. It's very very creative in terms of light painting photography. On top of that, it also has this adjustable handle. I can adjust the angle of the handle and also I can adjust the position of the handle. This comes in very handy for me to create different type of the light painting that I want. So for example, if let's say I want to do a rotation, I can just put this handle in the middle, set this like this, I can just rotate it easily. There's actually a marker here for you to uh, put it at exactly at the center location. Yeah. If you want to paint a one meter radius or you want to paint an almost two meter radius, you can actually go all the way towards the end here. If it's two meter radius, uh, thing that you can paint, then you can just do a round like that. Yep. The two meter radius. You can notice there's a spinning bearing barrel here that you can actually spin to do a perfect circle. Like for example, if you put this in the middle, you want to spin, you just hold here. Yeah. And you, with this, you can actually do a perfect circle. You also have this slot here for you to screw in and mount it on any tripod. And uh, one more feature of this uh, Maggie Light is splash proof with an uh, IPX4 rating. Means it is rain, sweat, and stain proof. We have shot before with Maggie Light under the slight drizzle yeah. and no problem at all. So now I insert the battery. There's a cable there, you have to attach the cable from this LED stick to the handle. So now just press on the blue button to turn it off. And that's the sound of the started. The system is started. The system is started. Okay, be careful. So mainly two features here. So one is that you can choose the color. You can choose the color based on some default preset. So you can customize it by changing the color on based on the RGB value. So this is how it looks like when it's turned on. When I have the light turned on, I just have to swing this Maggie light around, then you get the light painting result. And I also can control the bring level. So do you see, do you see the, the blinking? Other than the solid light, uh, this Maggie light can we, we can also input our own pictures into it. Do the pictures in the Photoshop and save it under a uh, bitmap file. You put a micro SD card here, and you can actually load the card, uh, load the photos inside here. There's a Malaysian flag here, so uh, let me show you how it's like. Okay. So over here, they are actually loading the whole uh, Malaysian bitmap pixel by pixel from left to right. So if you draw from here to here, you, on a camera you're using a slow shutter, okay, you can actually see the end result is the Malaysian flag. There's another thing I want to highlight is that this thing you also has this sound alert. I believe that you guys might have heard the big sound. Okay, okay. now you start the lighting thing and now you end. 
So it's very convenient as I don't need to keep checking on the screen or on the light. So, conclusion. So great, what do you think about this? I think it's very interesting and to be honest, it's a very innovative tool for light painting and I'm very impressed for what it can do. Uh, I think this is actually a very good tool uh, to complement night sky or even night portrait photography because this is a very simple setup and it is also very light. You can carry along to, to it where you want and you definitely can add some creative idea with this. So in case you may be interested about this Maggie Light product, so I have actually wrote a post about it. So I'm going to put the link there. In the page there, I also include some of those sample images that I have created for my light painting, like the, the Malaysia flag. Well, that's all for this episode. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, don't forget to click and subscribe uh, to our YouTube channel. If you have any comment you want to say, please leave us a message you know, below there. So that's all. Thank you and we hope to see you again in the future episode. See you next time. Bye. So, conclusion. What do you think, Chow? <laughs> <laughs> I cannot stop.